I'm back with another Scotch for the Common Man. It is the center of Nebraska, or east central Nebraska, and it is one degree outside, and this is before Christmas. That temperature sucks anytime, any place, but for us to have this in Nebraska before Christmas makes it extra crappy. But that said, I am here in my Star Wars t-shirt. There you go. Courtesy of Walmart. You don't get much more common man than that. But uh, tonight, I've got something I've never tried before, and that is the Famous Grouse Smoky Black. I've had Famous Grouse before, but I've never tried the Smoky Black. I actually just stumbled upon this. Uh, this evening at the liquor store, wanted something a little different, and this appears to be it. Um, it, it claims to be extra smoky. Haha, -ha, clever title, Smoky Black. But uh, we're going to give that a shot here, and uh, bear with me while I uncap this, because it is, ah, uh, the joyous screw top, but it's a blended scotch. You can't expect a whole lot more than that. Mm. It does have a nice, heavy, smoky flavor, uh, which, if you are not particularly good with scotches, uh, the smokiness, at least for me, goes very, very well in the winter time, especially on a cold night like tonight. Uh, I got my glass here, about a half ounce, uh, probably a little more, let's, let's hang on. Okay, got about a half ounce of water in this glass, I'm going to mix an ounce or so of scotch with it. It's probably closer to an ounce and a half. Hang on one moment. Got to cap off the bottle because if it spills, you know, that's all over but the crying. Okay, just swirling it around a little bit, mixing the water with the scotch. It does seem to have a nice coat to it, so it's, it's heavier than a lot of blended scotches, which is okay. It's still only 40% alcohol by volume, which is pretty standard for a scotch. Mmm has a nice full nose to it. Uh, it lingers and that's that's a bonus. A lot of blendeds will just kind of come and go and you're you're left with what's in the glass. This this has a nice nose to it. Mmm. Alright. Let's give it its first taste for the evening. Mm. Initial impressions. It has a uh, there is there's a little bit of honey to it. It's very smooth, very smooth. But it definitely has that oak base that it claims to have, the smoky black. Mm. It also coats very well. It has a lingering aftertaste, very pleasant. It is smoky, woodsy. Um, still has some of that honey taste to it. I have to say, this is a very good blended scotch. Uh, it, it, it does what it says it's going to do as a smoky black. It does have a heavy oak to it. A uh, little bit of a burn going down, which you expect from something that says it's smoky black, but it also has a lingering 
aftertaste that's uh, that's that's kind of where that honey comes into play um, this stuff could be dangerous this is this is a very very good blend I am already a big fan and I first time I've ever tested it this is this is some pretty good stuff you know not my favorite of all time but it's certainly going to rank among them as blended scotches go uh, gotta tell you this this was $23 for a $7.50 at the local liquor store and I'm gonna say it's worth every single penny if you like a heavier smokier scotch um, this is good stuff wow and uh, it doesn't burn the the aftertaste is like I say lingering but it doesn't it doesn't hold on to the smoky forever it just stays pretty true to what it is but it still has that uh, that smoky lingering taste to it this is a winner I gotta tell you uh, I, I've picked on J&B lately and Clan McGregor but uh, if you are trying to impress friends at a party this is a good inexpensive scotch to show off that uh, I think is worth every single penny I'm gonna sit here and enjoy a little more mm. I'm also curious I am a pipe smoker for those who didn't know that yet and uh, with me this evening I have some caramel apple pie from uh, pipesandcigars.com and uh, this first of all is a very good blend as well But just to put the two together, not a bad evening on a frigid frickin' winter night in the middle of Nebraska or the middle of anywhere. Hope this gives you a little insight into a very nice uh, blended scotch. Best of luck. Uh, drink responsibly, but uh, give this a shot. Famous Grouse Smoky Black, well worth the money. Have a great night.